look, I don't think you can empower others until you can empower yourself. Um, I don't think I have ever really considered myself to be uh, capable of being a leader, let alone a good leader. Um, but the fellowship has probably taught me that um, we all have strengths. It's just understanding what they are. Um, so for me, my lived experience is my strength. Um, and I feel like I now have the courage um, to speak up and empower other people to share their lived experience. So I think part of the answer lies in your question. Um, I think uh, relying only on the mental health system um, means that we're never going to create the change that we actually need. Um, we can't simply rely on mental health professionals and mental health policy makers to um, make the changes that we actually need. So I think with the fellowship in, in thinking about leadership, um, I've always considered leadership to be um, something that managers uh, need to have um, and you need to be in a leadership position to lead. Um, I think the fellowship for me has flipped that on its head um, and I think it's taught me really useful skills uh, to be able to lead from the bottom up, which I think is really important.